Morning Gluten, Women's History Month celebrates and recognizes the achievements of women throughout history. It officially started in 1987 when Congress passed a proclamation that declared March National Women's History Month. It is important to look to our past and recognize strong women who have influenced the world as we know it today. Ella Baker, a civil rights activist and a major role in the NAACP, Southern Christian Leadership Conference, and SNCC, um, she crafted campaigns for these groups, guided many famous civil rights leaders like Martin Luther King and Rosa Parks, and led the fight against racism and economic inequality. She was the first woman to be appointed the head of the New York chapter of the NAACP. Ella was nicknamed Fundy, a Swahili word meaning a person who teaches a craft to the next generation. Without her leadership and guidance, the fight for civil rights would not be as far as it is today. Marie Curie was a scientist and a leading figure in the study of radioactivity. She discovered two elements, polonium and radium, and worked long hours to discover the atomic weight of radium. She was the first woman to win the Nobel Peace Prize for her work in radioactivity. She went on to win a second Nobel Peace Prize in 1911 for creating a way to measure radioactivity, which made her the first person to win a Nobel Peace Prize in two fields, physics and chemistry. During World War II, she developed Petit Curies, which are small, mobile x-ray machines that saved countless lives on the front lines of the battlefield, helping to um, x-ray soldiers for lost bullets and shrapnel. Marie Curie has said, we must have perseverance and above all, confidence in ourselves, and has ins inspires women to pursue interest in STEM. Ruth Bader Ginsburg was the second Supreme Court Justice and has spent her time on the bench fighting for women's rights. Before becoming a Supreme Court Justice, she was director of the Women's Rights Project and the first woman professor at Rutgers Law School. As a lawyer, she has argued six landmark cases before the Supreme Court for gender equality and women's rights. She was appointed by President Bill Clinton in 1993 and is known for her strong voice in favor of gender equality, the rights of workers, and the separation of church and state. When asked about advice she would give young women, she has said to fight for the things that you care about, but to do it in a way that will lead others to join you. During Women's History Month, we honor all the fierce women who have fought for what they care about and created a pathway for women to pursue what we care about. Back to the anchors.